hey guys welcome back to another video so yeah she's back samantha full effect um i wanted to film an intro to the video if you guys remember i had a video that had two topics so i had to you know you guys chose to split the video because it was way too long so I realized I didn't have an intro for that video so yeah I just wanted to come out here and you know tell you guys don't forget to subscribe to my channel hit that notification bell if you guys want to know when I upload a video also don't forget to give me those like you know or hit me with a little comment or anything you guys want you know but yeah guys just wanted to jump on and give you like a quick intro and yeah without further ado let's jump into the video so before i roll the clip on the you know where i was talking about my favorites the video that i uploaded um like about a week or two ago um showing you the new skincare and the new makeup that I had gotten. So I told you guys that I was waiting on my Marc Jacobs bronzer and the BH Cosmetics brushes. I also got my lashes. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys that now. I know it's not my favorites, but you know, it's, they're, <coughs> excuse me, the bronzer and the lashes are quickly becoming my favorites. So, but I just wanted to show you guys so you guys can see the actual, <coughs> You know bronzer and brushes so the first thing is the brushes this is how they come in are they pretty they're called the miss bella they're a nine piece brush set so i'm not really sure on the pricing on how much i got these for but i know i got them on, they were like on sale but they come in like this little brush holder thing which I love and it's purple as well and you know the brushes I have not tested them out I'm, I will be doing a video testing them out but um, they're clean I don't want to dirty them but I will test them out for you guys I mean I have had two sets from BH Cosmetics so I know the brushes are good um, so I'm not concerned like worried that they're not going to work for me uh, but yeah this is how they come in and I'm obsessed with the packaging so those are the brushes. I also got the bronzer, which guys, oh, I'm obsessed. Look how pretty it is. Like she feels bougie AF with this bronzer. So it's the Marc Jacobs. The shade is 104 Tantastic and it's the Omega Bronze Coconut Perfect Tan. <clears throat> when I tell you the smell on this, oh, this to die for. I could swim in this. Look how big, like the mirror, how big the mirror is. Like, yes, excuse the mess. Um, but look at the size, like, I, and this is what I'm wearing on my face. Like, literally this is all I've been using um, since I got it. So I'm obsessed and it's so big. I'm sure I'm gonna use it for a long time because I have my, you've seen my physician form is, it's like almost hitting pan and I've had it over a year, so I'm not worried about this going to waste, like, at all, because I love it. So that was the bronzer out of makeup. I think that was the only thing that I was waiting for that I can recall. Um, the lashes that I mentioned that were from Priscilla Lashes, Priscilla Nicole Lashes, I did get those. And when I tell you she's obsessed, like, I even lost the, the little cover. Well, I, I ripped it, but... These are in the style A's, no, Scylla. These are short for her name, Priscilla. I washed them yesterday, so probably looking a little cray cray, but love them. Like I've been wearing them. Not, I'm not wearing them today, but um, I don't wanna use them up too much. Guys, so I got in the style 19. Look how fluffy they are. They're so fluffy and full. I did have to cut the uh, style Scylla, and I'm pretty sure I'll have to cut these two. And this is the style AZ, which is short for Arizona. That's where she lives. But yeah, guys, I'm obsessed with her lashes. 
again I had purchased from her previously like years ago and um, yeah I'm like obsessed with her lashes so those are the just the three things I think that I had gotten that I had mentioned that I have I was waiting on I did get my Fashion Nova order so I will do a try on haul for you ladies um, so you guys can see what I got but yeah now the original footage will roll now I'm just gonna jump in some of my favorite uh, stuff that I currently use uh, that I've been loving um, so I'll start with I guess how I do my 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 base and everything you guys know that my Neutrogena um, Hydro Boost water gel like this is my go-to like what I do before I apply my makeup um, and I also use my pearl essence rose water like these two like i use this you know just to, to to spray my face just to give me that hydration like when i go to the gym while i'm at work so you know i uh wash my face with water i know that's not cleaning but um my my face gets dry and i have one at work but i have like a coconut water one but that like it just refreshes you and you know it gives you hydration that you need especially right now when it's cold so yeah i you know these are my go-to's this is all i use um like before i apply my primer and things so yeah and then as far as primers go you know these two things right here are a match made in heaven so you know this is all i've been using um I, have, I can tell you like my skin is a combination skin so I will get oily in my t-zone which is my forehead my nose specifically more in my nose than anywhere else um, but right here is when I, I tend to get oily and with this like you know I, I just I don't care like I mean I, I do get a little bit dewy but she don't care like I, I live for this like this is my jam um, if you guys want to do like a, a mattifying primer, you guys can do the Soap and Glory one heck of a blot. Primer, this one's also good. Like if you apply it in your T-zone, like this will keep you matte. Um, so I did also, Juicy Jazz Girl, like she just got all the hookups. Um, but yeah, I use these, this one. Well, I was using this one before, my Tatcha, so no, nothing's replacing that at the moment, so. Yeah, I've been using, that's a, you know, this is a good primer as well if you guys want to check it out. Um, foundations, you guys know, um, I've been loving the Makeup Revolution um, Conceal and Define Foundation. Um, this is my jam, like this is what I'm wearing today. LA Girl Pro Coverage HD High Definition Foundation. I use the shade Natural. Oh, sorry, no, this is nude beige. Oh, I think I got the wrong, I thought I got new. I think she fucked up on the shade, but I mean, it doesn't look too bad, right? <laughs> I could have sworn that I got um, natural in the in the last one that I got like years back. Um, I had to get a new one because the other one was old. But yeah, she, she, I guess she's nude beige. But yeah, this foundation is so good. It just gives you, um, it doesn't make your skin so matte, like drying. Like there's some foundations there that are just too matte. Um, but you know, I, I love this one. Like, and this is so affordable. It's LA Girl, like they're so affordable. I think this is like eight bucks. Like it's so good, like so, so good. Like I would compare this to like a high um, brand, like what is it, Giorgio Armani. I mean, I've never tried those foundations just from people that I've seen like but they're this is such a good foundation like I haven't tried the matte one because I feel like my skin you know it, it's it's drying so if I add like a two, a two of a matte foundation it just doesn't look right so this one here obsessed I also love 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 L'Oreal um, infallible pro glow like this I've purchased I don't know how many times it's that good like I love it this I wore this one yesterday to go out and bitch this shit stayed like you know it, it gives you like that glow like it says and you know she was sweating dancing and everything like, <laughs> I love 
I'm obsessed with it. I'm in the shade 208 Sun Beige. This is the shade that I've always gotten. I don't know if it's my shade, but it blends in with my skin good. So yeah, uh, these right here, bomb. Like these, and again, drugstore brands. Like, you know, they just pop in. Like these two, again, the, the, um, Makeup Revolution, you know, I just started using this one, so I'm loving it too. Um, and you know, I get, I'll, I'll try that. Born This Way one, um, but you know, that one's like, she a little expensive, so she, she's gonna try not to use it as much, but yeah, right here, these two right here, I've, 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 I've purchased a couple times, so if anything, I recommend those. Um, you know, I've been loving, my Makeup Revolution concealer. Like this is what I use today as well. I used this one yesterday with the L'Oreal uh, foundation and both products mixed well. So this shit right here is, is good. Um, as well as um, the, you guys seen me using this one. It's, it's really good as well. Right now these are, these are like my go-tos. So I'm just gonna tell you guys about these two. Um, so once, you know, obviously I pour my foundation, my concealer, I'll set my, my, my base. So today I used, uh, this one from Rimmel and again, it just, your, your face is smooth guys, like smooth, like baby's butt. That's how smooth it is. Like it's good. So I'm, I think this is going to be my new one that I'm going to be using. Um, I also, the RCMA no color powder that one's also good so once i put the powder i'll go in with my bronzer you know um i've used this in the past my kat von d shade and light palette i don't know if this is still available honestly like when i went online to sephora i didn't see it like they i think they sell like the pans individually that you can replace it with um but yeah i've had this i've had this for a couple of years and it's still good, um, um, but yeah, I, I, you know, I like this one. Also, the Physicians Formula one, like this is what I use today. Like I just can't, and it smells delish, like hella good, like coconuts. And you guys see, she's been loved, like yeah. And again, I've gotten this a while, and you know, it still works great, like you know. So these bronzers. Um, the other one is the Chocolate Soleil. Uh, from Too Faced, I like that one as well. Um, so, you know, I'll dabble in, in each of one of those three, but when you get that Marc Jacobs one, I think that's gonna be life. So I can't wait to try that one. Um, then I'll go in with my blush. For blush, um, what I've been using is the either Laura Geller um, in the shade Tropic Hues. Um, it just gives you like a little luminosity when you put it on like a little um, sheen. Um, and and it, it's a pretty color, I, I like this. Um, also, the other one is the Note, um, from the brand Note, in the color Desert Rose. I did get both of those blush these blushes I've gotten in the BoxyCharm boxes. So yeah, I highly recommend, you know, I know they sell them um, either in Sephora, I believe. Um, but yeah, these are, these are good. Um, Blushes I that I use is the Burt Bees blush. This one is in Bare Peach. It's a, a cute color too. So these, I, this one I did purchase. Um, so yeah, um, but yeah. Those are the main blushes that I've used. That I, that I my go tos. Um, setting sprays. Um, my go tos have been this one from Morphe. It's called the Continuous Setting Mist. Like. It smells so good. Um, but yeah, I've been loving this one. Um, I also love the All Nighter from Urban Decay. Like this one's really good. Um, uh, Milani, their setting sprays. Like girl, they smell so good. Like I've gone through, I don't know how many on this, if there's a Make It Last. And then they have the Make, make, make It Dewy. Um, so this one gives you like that if you want, you don't want a matte, matte face. You spray some of this and it gives you like a little dewiness, which I did pour a little bit today. I guess mascara, if you guys are interested. Um, 
I have been using the Lancome Monsieur Big. I did get this um, when Ulta had like their 21 days sale. Um, you know, I picked it up that it was on sale. Um, it's good, like, you know, when I don't wear falsies, uh, I've used it. My, my, the problem with my lashes is that even if I curl them and then I'll go in with mascara, they tend to drop. Like, it doesn't matter what eyelash uh, mascara I use, it, they just droop down. Like, there's no saving them. So, and then I, I, I've also been using the Essence Volume Stylist. Like, I, I love this one for my lower lashes. They're just easier, you know, you know, you know, to to use. Uh, but yeah, these are the two that I've been using. Mainly this one I've been using because obviously when I get ready, it's I, I put lashes on, so I don't really go too crazy with the mascara. But yeah, these are good. Lipsticks. She got a whole shitload of them. Um, you know, these um, that I just got today. I mean, they feel good. They're a matte. If you don't like a matte, then you know, um, you could you could you can add like a little um, lip gloss if you want. Um, the Revlon lip glosses are good. Um, if you guys don't obviously don't want to spend, um, I don't even know how much these were honestly, um, but they're from Sally's. I don't think they're they're more than ten bucks. Um, just trying to think of good affordable lipsticks that you guys can try. Oh, ColourPop, hello. Like, you know, these lipsticks, so creamy. You guys haven't seen my review, go check it out. Um, so good, I love these. Um, these are very affordable. They're all their lipsticks, liquid lipsticks, lipsticks, so good. Highly recommend them. Um, and then I wanted to also, um, chat with you and, and give you some of my favorite like brushes that I use like my sponges so the sponges that I've been like the sponge that I've been using like my go-to it's been this uh, elf sponge it is so good like I just ugh, I just can't like I haven't not used it since I got it and obviously you guys can tell um, I've been using it since I saw juicy jazz review it like she's been raving about it I, I, I get it why, it's, it's so good. I, I did pick up uh, this one as well a while back um, from uh, Japanese, um, and it looks like this. Obviously, when you wet it, it grows a little bit. This one's pretty, it's, it's also good, I like it, but I like this one more. Like, this is the one that I've been reaching out to more. This one is also good, like, I love this one. This was the one that I was using before I got the e.l.f. one. This is the one that I was using, because it's so good, because you can contour, like, setting here like it's just so good and you know with the point you can get into those corners there this one's also good like it's like seven dollars if you get it for morphe or if you go to ulta they also have it so love it um for brushes um i as you've seen when i apply my foundation i'll go in with a brush first so you know these are my go-to right here my morphe y6 and this one I got from BH Cosmetics from a set, which I'm getting new. I, I order brushes from BH Cosmetics as well. Forgot to mention that. So I can't wait to try those out. Um, but yeah, this came in a set. I tried looking for them. They don't have this set anymore, sorry. Um, but yeah, like it's like a, like a kabuki brush, but I love these brushes to apply my makeup. And then I'll go in with the sponge to just make sure it's all set. Um, and, and right here, like in the, in the nose area like i'll go in with my sponge just to make sure that you know it doesn't look all cakey but yeah these are like my brushes that i use um mainly these are the only two that i use um i you know when this one's too dirty i'll go in with this one and then <clears throat> but these are the two that i want <coughs> excuse me guys she's thirsty um i was gonna pick up a japanese foundation brush today but it was $16 and she got two and she's getting a couple brushes right now so she said no but yeah th these are my foundation brushes that I love um, to do my bronzer um, I'm sorry the concealer I these are this is the, con the, the brush that I'll use to blend my concealer first and then again I will go in with my my sponge just to make sure everything excuse me is 
blended and it just looks seamlessly. Um, so this is the Morphe M536 and also I'll go in with the Morphe M173. This one I use like for the inner corners because obviously sometimes with the sponges you can't really get into there. So I'll go in with this and I'll, you know, blend any creased like area, like my forehead, you know, she got hella lines. So, you know, I'll go in and just blend and again, I'll go in with my sponge. So these are the two brushes that I like to use when applying my concealer. For bronzer, um, I've been using this one here. Um, this is from Luxie. It's the 552, sorry, 522 Taper Highlighter. So this is supposed to be for highlighting, but I do it for contouring. Um, for, you know, bronzer and contour. I've been using this one. I've also used this one, which is from Morphe as well, R14. I did get this um, in a couple of the other brushes, like the Y6, um, when Laura Lee came with her uh, collab with Morphe. So I've been using this one and between these two, I also use this one from BH Cosmetics, which is um, from another set. This set is on their website if you guys want to check it out. Uh, but yeah, I use this one for contouring. Like I'll contour like right here and I'll put the bronzer. Um, so yeah, she uses like three brushes for that. Uh, I've also been using this brush um, from Wet n Wild, doesn't have a number. It was like from a collection that I got last year. Um, but I use this for my nose contour, so I'll grab a little bit of bronzer and you know, you know, try and contour this nose and you know, a little bit underneath my lip here. Um, so yeah, I, I like this little brush here. Um, for blush, I will go in with the Morphe E4. Again, this is from that Laura Lee collab brush set that she did with um, Morphe. I mean, I'm sure that they had this brush, but it was part of their, the the set that she did. But yeah, I love this one for, for blush. Like it just gets right in there. Um, so once I've done my every, all the powders, um, I'll go in with this brush from Ulta. It's, uh, it's, called, it's a highlighting brush, but I use it to just to blend everything. Like sometimes you'll have like your lines too harsh or or any, you know, just, I just use this to blend all my, my makeup together and it just does a great job. Like, I love it. And those are pretty much the brushes that I use for my face. Like for eyes, girl, there's so many and they're all dirty. Like, it's so bad. Like I've been using the ones that I got from the, the November um, BoxyCharm. Like I've been using these. Um, yeah, you know, I I used um, for my eyebrows when I clean, do the concealer, I've been using the, oh, I can't, it's already, the, the name is fading. That's how much I use it. Um, but I did get it from BoxyCharm as well. Uh, I think it's called Alamar. Um, but yeah, I use this one too, my concealer to clean up my eyebrows. Um, yeah, guys, um, these are like the type of, brushes again I got this one from a boxy charm these are a morphe this is a 441 you know these are good to blend or to um, like a clean brush like if it's clean and you want to just blend everything together these are great for that um, this one I use for my eyebrows as well once I've cl to clean up uh, once I've gone in um, with the concealer um, for my eyebrows you know, when I use my ink, oh, I didn't even talk to you about, you know, what I use for my eyebrows. This is the only thing that I've been using right now, which is the Cat Cabrow, Bene it's from Benefit, the Cabrow Gel, and I'm in shade four. Like this, I've been, this is my second one that I used. It's so good. Um, right now, it's been like over a month since I've gone to, to do my eyebrows. So, send Jesus, like it's so bad, but, yeah, this is the one that I'll be using because I, you know, when I do do get my eyebrows done, I will go in with. Um, so it's a powder. It's called the Brow Gal. Um, this again from a boxy charm box that I got a while back. Um, but yeah, it looks like this. So I'll dabble into these two, yeah, these two shades. Um, these I'll use towards the end, and then I'll go in this one in towards the front. And the brush that I use when I use the 
the benefit I use the elf um, eyebrow dual brush that's what it's called I use this one um, I love this one this is what I've been using and then when I got this it came with a brush so I'll use that brush with, with that hey guys just wanted to jump on here because believe it or not when I was filming earlier um, she forgot to mention highlights like what the <laughs> like how could I forget I had them right here and I completely forgot don't know how that happened but yes I want to just jump on here and just tell you guys about the uh, highlights that I've been using currently there's you know a whole bunch in the market um, so you know I've been raving about the Jeffree Star uh, skin Fro supreme frost and it's in the wet dream um, and Anastasia Amrizi, like these are my go-to's right now. Like, you know, I, I got this when it came out, I think like last year. Um, she recently came out with it again. So I, I highly recommend it guys. You know, it's, I believe it's like 20, $27, but it's so worth it. Like this is what I'm wearing today. Um, and today I'm not wearing much makeup. Um, I did use the Arborium um, CC cream that I, that I mentioned earlier this beautiful thing here um, so that's all I have on my face um, I did put a little bit of blush um, obviously highlight um, but that's it guys I'm not wearing any eyeshadow I did put my lashes because you know she can't go out without lashes now <laughs> and I did my eyebrows because I have not done my eyebrows in over a month but yeah uh, but yeah guys this thing is bomb as you can tell like it gives you a little bit of color and it's perfect and I did uh, go ahead and set it with the stay matte um, setting powder um, and I'm obsessed with this it's like my skin feels like a baby's butt like I'm not even joking with you guys so I highly recommend those two um, but yeah uh, but yeah guys that's pretty much what um, the stuff that I use like my favorites you could say um, you know you guys don't have to pick up every single thing that I say here I'm just giving you recommendations uh you know so you know you can make your makeup last and you know look good throughout the day if, if you're going out um but yeah these are my recommendations and my go-to's um and i live for them and yeah guys thanks again for sitting down and watching my video don't forget to subscribe to my channel hit that notification bell when you know if you guys want to know when i upload a video and also please show me love you know give me some likes uh, that is it for today thanks for watching bye guys